This is babies and toddlers. Where do you guys think we should start? Sarge, didn't you mention music? Affirmative, Goofy! Hmm... Alright. Why don't we look for things that make noise? Sure! That's the problem for you! What do you mean, for me? Hey, where are you... Tunnel? <laughs> I think they really are good guys. Well, you wouldn't have trusted them otherwise. And I know that your trust is a hard-earned treasure. Well, for all our sakes, let's hope you're right, cowboy. I'm willing to give him a chance at least for a little while longer. Especially if it means getting Andy and our friends back. Agreed. Gorge! Well, I'm kinda worried about our new friends. <laughs>
Is this it? Come on, Sora. You've never used a record player? <laughs> huh? Like this. Whoa! <laughs> Did that sound off to you? I did. Huh? Hey, hey! Sora! There's some kind of strange noise coming from the orchestra! <laughs> Got it! Woody, you keep the record going. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> this is the one! <laughs> yeah! Uh... Hmm. Something seems to be stuck in this tuba. I'll get it out. Oh. Uh, almost got it. 
There! <laughs> Corporal! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You all right, son? Uh, yes, sir. That's the soldier Sarge lost contact with. So, you found Ham? Yes, but while I was radioing in, a giant hand grabbed me, and it stuffed me in there. They must have taken Ham to another location. We have to hurry. Wait, Corporal. You're not fit for action. But Sarge... Your tour is over, son. And it's all right. Our trusted allies will take over. I will move the Corporal to a safer location. Good luck, gentlemen. Huh? Hey, 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 hey! What is going on? Oh, right! Woody! Mission complete! Why didn't you tell me a little sooner? Oh. 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 Sorry, there's no time to rest. Oh. Ham yeah. needs us. Oh. 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 Talk about cabin fever. Uh -huh. Thanks for the save. You okay, Ham? Yeah, aside from being locked in, the accommodations are fine. Ah, what a tiny little house. Uh -huh. Whoa! Uh -huh. Who was... Is... Uh, 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 What's wrong? Uh, she's back. That's uh -huh. the doll that big fed me. Ham, take cover. Uh, copy that. One stay in the dread breakfast was enough for me. Not another possessed toy. Guys, look alive.
showtime! Wait. Mm -hmm. What if we end up just like her? Forgetting ourselves and attacking each other. No way, Buzz. That won't happen. No way. You guys are too strong. You can't be sure. What if I get taken over then attack you? Buzz, you're overthinking it. Yeah. The Heartless, the Darkness, can only creep in when our hearts falter. Trust me, you'll be fine if you don't lose heart. Well, that's good. Because I know you, Buzz. You'll never lose heart when it comes to your friends. True enough, cowboy. Sorry to have worried you all. No problem. Now, <laughs> let's go find the others. Huh? <laughs> the flying saucer! I think I know who that might lead us to. Come on, guys! <laughs> hey, Woody! Uh, I just slow you down with all the loose change I'm carrying. I'll hang by the entrance. No problem. Be safe, Ham. Yeah. Hey, thanks, buddy. You just take care of your old self. Now, let's follow that UFO. Right! right. Put this in the mail. I wonder what it's good for. Don't forget to mail that off. Yeah. They have come for us. The mystic portal awaits. Oh, no! Wait! Stop! Farewell! It's getting away! <laughs> Don't go!
get up from far away? Perhaps if we use the cannons on those mechs. No more! Nirvana will not be reached. <sighs> Sorry I trashed your ride. Fear not. We still have our new home. The Chamber of Andy. They're right. This isn't where we belong. We've been in this toy store long enough. It's time for us to go home to Andy's room. But... Xehanort told us that room isn't even his real room. Can you prove that any of that nonsense is true? Oh. And even if that Andy's room is fake, it doesn't mean he's not somewhere in this world with us. I'm going home to wait for him. No more debate. You with me, Woody? Hmm. You're right, Buzz. Now that we're all accounted for... We should meet up at the entrance and go home. Okay. We could have used friends like you for the final showdown. But Organization 13's our problem to solve. Yeah, I can take him. I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, can we see you off? That would be great. Sarge, roll call. Sir, yes, sir. Roll call. All toys fall in. 
Sarge, army men times four. Ham, aliens, one, two, three. Wait, where's Rex? Eh, he took off. Said he wanted to prove to you you could trust Sora. He's up there by the video games. <sighs> well, here we go again. Huh? This is about us? <laughs> He's not safe. The Heartless are out there. You're right. Sora. Donald. Goofy. Any chance you could help us one last time? Sure! Right. <sighs> Thanks, guys. Pam said Rex was in the video game section. Oh boy, let's go!
Find some ingredients around here. never looked this good. The clothes kind of match. Huh? Hmm? What do you know? They are video game figures. See? I told you, Buzz. They're toys. Just like the rest of us. <gasps> well, I suppose. Donald, I thought your magic decided how I look. Explain. <laughs> Say, Riku would make a great action figure. <laughs> no, it's me. I've got the black clothes and, uh... So what? All right, everyone. Now that we're back together... It's time to return to Andy's room. Now? But can't I at least check the strategy guides? I want to know how to beat Bahamas! <sighs> Next time. Oh. Right now we need to go home. Oh, but you needn't rush off. Xehanort! Uh -huh. I have more to observe. I can't let you leave yet. It's us that you really want. Leave the others out of this. <laughs> you would say that, Champion of Light. Very well. Let's get to the final stage. <gasps> Buzz? What's the matter? <gasps> 
<sighs> Come on, Buzz. Quit fooling around. Ah! I can't believe it. Buzz has been taken over? <sighs> what did you do to him? I thought I made it clear. I am testing the strength of their bonds. In this world, toys have hearts. And those hearts come from a powerful bond. So what happens when those bonds are stretched to their limit? When they are worlds apart, can cloth and plastic hold on to their hearts? All I needed was a wedge to widen the divide. Someone like you to fill them with distrust and doubt. And that chasm you created can be filled with a vast darkness. Witness it for yourself. Do something! <laughs> On my way! Not this time. Haven't you heard? In this world, you come from a video game. So now you can watch my experiment from inside that screen. That is, if you manage to find a moment's rest. There's got to be a way out. Buzz, Woody, hang on.
Yeah, keep them coming. Sora! You all right, Sora? Yeah, I'm just fine. And you? Oh. Wait, where's Buzz? <sighs> he disappeared into a dark corridor. Oh. Sora, how do we get him back? I don't know. My power won't open those. <sighs> Sir, did I hear you say Dark Corridor? That's right, Sarge. Any ideas? Well, it might be a long shot, but we've sighted a shadowy portal in the Kid Corral. We can infiltrate from a window inside babies and toddlers. I'll head there and get it open. Sarge, you're a lifesaver! You guys in? Yeah! yeah! Please promise you'll bring Buzz home. With batteries included? Journey safely. Farewell. Don't worry. <laughs> We're going to get our friend back. We want to rescue Buzz. Come on, fellas. Sora, look! That must be the window Sarge mentioned. The entrance was blocked by blocks? Can you use the gigas to move them? Yeah, maybe. I'll try.
How are we gonna reach that? Well, there are some more blocks here. This town ain't big enough. I'm over there!
up to the dark corridor.
It looked like this? Yep. Here goes. Nord. What do you want with my friend? Look, such tremendous darkness. All because he was ripped away from the boy who cares about him most. Does that mean... we'll all be like Buzz? If we don't find Andy? Wrong! Distance doesn't matter. Andy's part of their hearts, just like my friends are part of mine. <clears throat> you can't rip that apart! <sighs> what? Your friends are your power? <laughs> How very true. But if the light of friendship is a form of power... The darkness of being alone is a power even greater. Darkness is the heart's true nature. Whatever you're talking about, I don't care. Put Buzz back the way he was, then get lost. Or else what, Toy? Yeah. I am a toy. And a friend. My guess is no one's ever loved you before. Because you know nothing about hearts and love. There are hearts all around us, trying to connect. Your loneliness only made Woody and Buzz's connection stronger. That's the heart's true nature, to never ever let go. Wherever they are, Andy and the other toys haven't let go either. Yeah, you can't keep us from Andy. We're going home no matter what. And taking Buzz. Xehanort, you're so caught up in finding the shadows, you forgot about the light that cast them. No. <laughs> <laughs> Woody, now! Giddy up, partner. We gotta get this wagon train a moving. Woody. Wait, how did I get here? Hmm. Oh, I don't know. Maybe somebody switched you into dark and stormy mode. But I don't have a... <sighs> Thank you, Woody. Good to have you back, Buzz. Hey, come up! Huh? We can't hold him much longer! Don't give up, guys! <laughs> oh! <laughs> So, even empty puppets can be given strong hearts. I am going to have to remember that. Remember this. Our hearts will always be connected to Andy's. No matter what you do. And that's something you'll never understand. Because you're hollower than any toy. But now I know a heart can be placed in the vessel of our choosing. For that... Let me give you a parting gift to play with. Wait! Find the hearts joined to yours. Huh? Oh. There! Careful! Whoa! Yeah! 
Here goes.
So Xehanort got away again! Yeah! He's a big chicken! I'm sorry. What? Hmm? I wanted to get you back to the real world. <sighs> it does seem that we're trapped here. We'll never get home. Yeah, stuck like pigs. Our position appears fixed. Oh, no! Oh. A shame we'll have to stay a little longer. With our new best friends. Huh? Huh? After all the adventures we've had, we're not quite ready to say so long. <laughs> you guys... I'm sorry that I was being so stubborn. Please forgive me. Hey, you were just looking out for your friends. No biggie. Yeah, somebody's got to be the sensible one. Huh? Especially since Woody's always getting in trouble. Gorge, that sounds a little like Sora, don't it? Huh? Yeah, I love the Pokemon one. Like Buzz. Kinda. <laughs> 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 Besides, if we do go back to the real world, we'll never see you again, right? Oh. But what about Andy? You care about him so much. Oh. And he's still right here with us. Oh. If we follow our hearts, we'll find them again. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So, Sora, are you going after the guy in the black coat? Something tells me we can't join you on that mission. That's okay, because you become part of our hearts. Oh. So let us become a part of yours. <laughs> 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 Thank you! <laughs> now, off you go! To infinity and beyond!
wanted. You had to remind me? Well, gorge. We just want to help keep you motivated. I was thinking about Roxas. He's trapped here in my heart. But he needs a body to be himself again. Well, don't worry. Yenzo's working on a way to get him free. I'll bet you he's got the perfect body all lined up. You've got the gummy phone, Sora. Why don't you try giving him a call? Uh, I guess so. Yeah, why not? Oh, hiya, Sora. Your Majesty! <laughs> Hey, uh, hey, what? Wrong number? No, Rico and I are visiting Radiant Garden. Actually, we were just about to call you guys, but it looks like you beat us to the punch. Sora, is something wrong? I wanted to pick your brain. In order for us to recomplete Roxas, he needs a body, right? Yeah, to put his heart in. Hmm. Oh, replicas. Huh? Well, replicas are basically human. Oh, uh, what? Oh, yeah. You wouldn't remember. The previous Organization 13 developed replicas, realistic vessels to place hearts in. They're so real, in fact, that you'd actually mistake them for people. And with hearts, the replicas will become people. Cool. But if we get our hands on a replica, will Roxas look like himself when he's recompleted? Yup. The replica takes the form of the heart inside it. That's perfect! I'll talk to Ienzo. He was in the organization back then, so he might know more. Great. Thanks. Wait. Do you guys think they're after replicas, too? Nope, they definitely said a black box. Who's that? The organization and Maleficent. Oh, oh. Uh, mm. I guess we forgot to mention it. Huh, it's okay. But there's something you guys should know about one of their members. Huh? So let the rest of us worry about Roxas and Naminé for now. You journey on and keep an eye out for Terra. No, yes, your Majesty. Stop that! <laughs> <laughs> they don't change, do they? <laughs> nope, that's their best quality. Well, we gave Merlin the vestments for Kyrie and Axel. Let's go stop by Ansem the Wise's study. Right.
Why can't I go outside? The outside world is a dangerous place. You must stay here where you're safe. Do you understand, Flower? Those lights appear every year on my birthday, only on my birthday, and I can't help but feel like they're... they're meant for me. I need to see them, and not just from my window, in person. I have to know what they are. It sure is a pretty day. <clears throat> yeah, the weather is great. It'd be perfect for a picnic. Why do you think we came here? Got me, Donald. We'll figure it out as we go. <sighs> okay. I'm sure we were brought to this world for some good reason. But can't we sweat it later? Fine with me. I swear it does no harm. Oh. Oh. <laughs> make way! Make way! Make way! Oh. <laughs> Heartless! <sighs> you see? Soon as you mention them, they show up. There goes our picnic. I, I didn't do it. It's okay. Let's send these guys packing. Say, since you three seem to know what you're doing, mind if I leave this one to you? Yep. We'll take care of them. Go on, skedaddle. You have my thanks. Whew. The horse was enough. Don't need any monsters on my trail. Now what was enough? Oh, nothing. Nothing. Name's Flynn, Flynn Rider. Oh, watch out. They look mad. here
Where'd Flynn go? I think I saw him go that away. Huh? But that away is just a dead end. Yeah, that's puzzling. Well, did he? Hmm. I say we investigate. Flynn, where are you? Flynn? Let's see. Wait, I need a minute. Cheese.
He got away safe, right? Huh? Hey, now Sora's gone too. This way, guys. It's a secret passage. <sighs> oh. How you doing? The name's Flynn Ryder. How's your day going? Huh? Who else knows my location, Flynn Ryder? All right, hang on, Blondie. Rapunzel. Gesundheit. Here's the deal. I was in a situation gallivanting through the forest when I stumbled upon it. Oh. Oh, no, no. No, 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 no. Where is my satchel? I've hidden it. Somewhere you'll never find it. So, what do you want with my hair? To cut it? Huh? Sell it? No! Wait, you don't want my hair? Why on earth would I want your hair? Look, I was being chased, I saw a tower, I climbed it, okay? End of story. Hmm? Huh? Okay, Lynn Ryder. I'm prepared to offer you a deal. A deal? Look this way. <clears throat> Do you know what these are? You mean the lantern thing they do for the princess? Lanterns? I knew they weren't stars. Well, tomorrow evening, they will light the night sky with these lanterns. You will act as my guide, take me to these lanterns, and return me home safely. Then, and only then, will I return your satchel to you. That is my deal. Yeah, no can do. Unfortunately, the kingdom and I aren't exactly simpatico at the moment, so I won't be taking you anywhere. Something brought you here, Flynn Rider. Call it what you will, fate, destiny. So I have made the decision to trust you. A horrible decision, really. I am serious. Oh. <clears throat> Let me get this straight. I take you to see the lanterns, bring you back home. Then you give me back my satchel? I promise. And when I promise something, I never, ever break that promise. Ever. Oh, what to do? I cannot let her find that tiara. Okay, just think. I need the satchel, and Blondie has it. There might be more monsters out there. I've got it. The three guys in the funny outfits. They look tough enough to come in handy. All right, fine. I'll take you. But on ah. one condition. My three sidekicks come along. Hmm. 
Look at that! A tower! <sighs> Let's check it out! Who put a tower here? Let's go find out! 